I know it doesn't exactly well, show what yeah. I do. Uh, and I, I have one big pet peeve, and it's a gym pet peeve. And what that is is when I'm in the gym, don't talk to me. <laughs> yes? Yeah. yeah. I, I don't care what the situation is. Like, William, the gym's on fire. I don't care. <laughs> I want to feel the burn. That joke is almost as bad as talking to me in the gym. <laughs> the biggest offenders are wannabe trainers. You know, I'm not on steroids. But if you need some, I know a guy. <laughs> <laughs> They'll interrupt my workout and be like, hey, do you need help with your workout? No, 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 do you need help with your social skills? <laughs> I have my headphones in and I'm using my angry face. <laughs> It's New York. We all have an angry face, right? Yeah. yeah. For the subway, for like sex, I don't know how to use it. Uh, what's, what's funny with me is my angry face never matches my music. It's like, Arr. and I am telling you, I'm not going. It's also interesting, my real angry face is this. What? What's that, United? You canceled my second flight today? Oh, oh. Uh, yeah, I, I also, uh, I, I don't like it even when hot girls talk to me in the gym. Hot girls talk to you? They do! <laughs> I don't know why that laugh was so big. <laughs> what they do, they can talk to me, they, they always say the same thing, and what that is is, are you done with the Stairmaster? <laughs> no, no I'm not! <laughs> so secret, you guys, my Stairmaster workout is two hours long! <laughs> My ass is so strong, Woo! and my knees are so weak. It's just like, crack, 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 crack. Is someone making popcorn? No, 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 William's going downhill right now. Uh, the reason I work out so much is I, I love to eat. Do we like to eat? We like to eat? Twice a week, I will eat a full DiGiorno pizza. It's disgusting. I feel disgusting, but as they say, it's not delivery. It's a compulsion. Please stop me. Please. It's disgusting. Um, I'm also unhealthy before I go to the gym. I need to amp myself up. Are we a, are we a coffee crowd? Uh, so you drink coffee. Do you drink coffee to wake up in the morning or to take a poop? <laughs> yeah. Mostly number one, but maybe a little bit number two. Great. Oh yeah. Audiences always pull back on that joke, like, Ugh. but my coffee friends are like, I don't know. I pour the brown liquid here, and as soon as it hits brown liquid, come down there. So I know I'm not crazy. Uh, I, I can't make fun of coffee drinkers though, because I do five-hour energy. Yeah. Ugh. Ugh. It's, it's a bunch of caffeine, like two days worth of vitamins and a strong aroma of battery acid. <laughs> it's how you know it's working. I can taste the electricity. <laughs> um, but I've gotten, like, I've gotten too used to it. Now I have to use their more intense product. It has three times all the ingredients of regular five-hour energy. <laughs> they make 15-hour energy? No, it's called five-hour energy extra. <laughs> Whatever voodoo magic it is, it only lasts for five hours. Five hour energy regular, you take it, you're like, oh, I'm feeling, uh, you know, kind of buzzed, I'm ready to work out. Five hour energy extra, you take it, you're like, I'm feeling really buzzed because there are bees in my head. <laughs> Am I awake? Of course, because I'm seeing the face of God right now. I might have taken one before the show. <laughs> oh, it explains so much. <laughs> okay, so I don't like when people talk to me in the gym. What do you like, William? I like silence. Acknowledgement. <laughs> I, I, there's so many people in my gym that I have such kind regards for. There's this one guy, every time we walk by each other, we go, yeah. <laughs> what that means is one more, whatever it is, one more rep, one more minute on the treadmill, just one more. There's this old lady that has the same workout schedule as me. Whenever one of us is late, we'll be like, mm -mm. <laughs> These are my favorite people in the entire world. I don't even know their names. <laughs> and I don't want to. I ran into that guy on the street one day with his wife and his baby. I know what the fuck to say. I was like, hey, you? Did you work out today? Nice kid. One more. <laughs> But even silence 
haven't we? I've had some weird experiences in the gym. I once had a guy open my shower door and just go, eh? And I was just like, no! The whole interaction. I'll leave you guys with this with one thing. Um, one day, I, I used to run uh, uh, marathons on the treadmill, which sounds cool, but it was just so I could watch Saturday morning cartoons. That's the cool thing I do in the gym. So I finish it. I finish a marathon on the treadmill. I'm giving like like high fives to people on the treadmill next to me. I'm blowing kisses to my gym crush. Like, <laughs> however, I'm not paying attention, so I trip and fall. Now, anyone who's happened that before knows that the tread keeps smelling. <laughs> so I get slammed against the wall, and like the loudest noise ever shoots out. Basically, like the treadmill said, "Loser, loser." Uh, my gym crush comes to help me, but I just ran a marathon. So I'm like, "Oh God, uh, please think of me as a sexual option." If I was clever, I could have been smooth. I could have been like, "Oh, I thought I was gonna be picking you up." <laughs> <laughs>